Independence Day in Ukraine is the biggest holiday, usually celebrated in all cities with festivals. It is a day to remember the heroes of Ukraine's past and honor those who fought and died to secure their long-desired independence. The state-building experience of Ukrainians, our culture, our identity, our Ukrainian character are more than a thousand years old. We are opening our event, being as far as more than 3,000 kilometers from our homes. <laughs> Today is a really special day for Kilkenny. It's a day to celebrate Ukraine's independence. It's also a day to celebrate the new friends, the new family, the new nation that we've come to greet in our city. Um, we're really happy to have you here, even if it is in difficult circumstances. The bonds of friendship are getting stronger. The people of Ukraine, I think, are beginning to realize that they've got friends here on the edge of the Atlantic. And I think that over the next few months, as hopefully peace begins to settle and we start to see a solution to the Ukraine war that we will see our friends return to their homeland while always remembering the bonds of friendship and love that we've created in these special months. I am very proud to wear the, blue, the beautiful blue and yellow colours today and to join with you in celebrating this momentous occasion. It's been really good for us to be challenged in the everyday work that we do to do it differently, to be able to respond to something as important and as big as this. It's also been really nice to see your faces around the town and actually over time become you know, definitely part of the fabric of who we are now in this county. Kilkenny is so proud to show our solidarity with the people of Ukraine at this difficult time, and we want them to know that we're with them every step of the way. Although, for now, peace in Ukraine appears to be nowhere in sight, preserving unity now and working together for victory is the most important national task that we all will definitely fulfill. We will win in this war for independence. We'll continue our course towards United Europe, towards full membership in the EU, and intentions to become one of the most modern states in the world.